In the fierce battlefield of AI video generation, where giants like Runway, Sara 2, VO 3.1, and Kling dominate, the Pixverse AI has managed to carve out a meaningful and lasting place for itself. Back when almost no one had even heard of Pixverse, I made a tutorial about it, which thankfully received an incredible response from you guys. Soon after, with the release of Pixverse V3 and its massive growth, I created a follow-up tutorial. If you missed those, definitely check them out later on my channel. And now, with the innovative new features and major upgrades in Pixverse V5, I'm excited to bring you the third dedicated Pixverse tutorial. Pixverse is a powerful AI video generator that offers advanced features like text-to-video and even image-to-video. There are a bunch of golden tips hidden throughout this tutorial on how to create awesome videos and animations with this AI. So make sure to watch till the very end. Hi everyone, my name is Iman. This is the Iman Global YouTube channel. Welcome back to a new tutorial. Please support my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get started. Iman Global YouTube channel. First, I search for Pixverse on a web browser. In just a few seconds, I can access its official website. With excitement, I click the login button at the top right corner. You can sign up or log in using your Apple, Discord, or Google account. I click sign in with Google, select one of my Gmail accounts already logged into the browser, and sign in. Right after logging in, Pixverse gives us 60 free daily credits. You can check this at the top right corner of the site under your profile icon. Clicking on the token balance opens the plans page. As you can see, we're currently on the free or basic plan. In this plan, you get 91 time credits as a sign-up bonus and 60 daily credits that refresh every day. And just to clarify, Pixverse is not sponsoring me. It's also possible that the number of free daily credits could change or even be removed in the future. So if you're watching this tutorial when that's already happened, don't accuse me of lying. I'm telling you up front. I always aim to keep things honest with you guys. Now, I click on the Refer and Earn option at the bottom left of the screen. Here, by completing simple tasks, like watching ads or finishing your profile, you can earn extra credits for generating more videos and animations. Alright, let's generate our first video using Pixverse V5. From the left menu, I click on Video. At the bottom of the screen, there's a text box for entering your prompt. Write your idea in as much detail as possible so that even someone with no context could visualize your concept. Include details like scene elements, emotions, colors, character movements and poses, background and foreground items, location, time of day, and even camera movements. The more complete your description, the better the AI will understand your vision. I already have a prompt written, so I paste it into the text box. Now let's go over the settings. The first option is the model selection. At the time of this recording, there are three versions available, 4, 4.5, and 5. Naturally, I'll go with the newest one, version 5. Next is the duration setting. You can choose between 5 seconds and 8 seconds. A 5 second video costs 30 credits, while the 8 second version costs 40. I'll go with 5 seconds here to save some credits. Under resolution, you can pick from 360p. 540p, HD, or Full HD. The 360p option only costs 20 credits, but higher resolutions will consume more. The Preview Mode option lets you generate four low-quality preview videos in one go. You can then pick the one you like best and upscale it to high quality. This approach saves credits, gives you more control, speeds up processing, and results in a better final output. In Aspect Ratio, you can choose between Square, Horizontal, or vertical formats. If you're creating content for platforms like Instagram, TikTok, or YouTube Shorts, go with vertical. But since I'm making this for YouTube long-form videos, I'll select the 16 to 9 ratio. By enabling auto sound, you can describe the kind of sound you want, for example, waves crashing on the shore. The AI will then generate a video with matching sound effects, though it might take a bit longer to process. The next option is auto speech. When you turn it on, you can have the AI add realistic human voice lines directly into your video. Just type in the character's dialogue, like hello everyone or I love you, and the AI will automatically generate a natural human voice for it. In the styles section, you can choose from comic, cyberpunk, anime, 3D animation or clay. I've tested all of them, and honestly, they all perform pretty well. 
But for me, the anime style delivers the best results. So if you're into creating anime-inspired videos, this one's definitely worth trying. Next up, there's an option called Enable Off-Peak Mode. When it's turned on, your videos are generated during low server traffic hours, helping you save up to 50% of your credits. Usually, the results are ready in less than an hour. However, keep in mind that this feature, along with batch generation, is only available for pro and premium users. Finally, in the Create Count section, you can choose to generate anywhere from 1 to 4 videos simultaneously in a single processing run. Of course, this will consume more credits, but it's a great option when you want to produce multiple variations or test different outputs at once. Now let's talk about the seed setting. Think of it as giving the AI a random starting point, a kind of hidden luck number that determines how your video or image turns out. If you use the same prompt and settings but change the seed, the results will look different because the AI starts from a new random point. But if you keep the same seed, even if you regenerate the video multiple times, the output will be identical. That's why advanced users usually write down the seed number when they like a particular result, so they can recreate it later exactly as it was. With all these settings in place, 20 credits are deducted from my balance. I click the Create button, and my request enters the processing queue. After a short moment, the text prompt is transformed into a full video. When I hover the mouse over it, I can access the delete and download options. Let's open the video in a larger view and take a closer look. I'm pretty happy with how this video turned out, but I want to boost the quality even more. So I click on the upscale option. It deducts 30 tokens from my balance. I confirm it and the upscale process begins. After a short while, the video is delivered in stunning 4K quality. The results of the text-to-video process in Pixverse V5 are absolutely stunning. I'm genuinely blown away. But what do you think? With tools like Sora 2 and VO 3.1 emerging, is Hollywood's dominance coming to an end? The download button is located right below the video frame, and if you want a longer clip, there's an extend option in the bottom right corner that lets you increase the video's duration. Pixverse also offers another powerful feature, image to video. If you have a photo of yourself, your loved ones, friends, or anyone else, get it ready. We're about to bring it to life. I've already covered how to generate AI images in my previous tutorials. So if you haven't seen those, check out the playlist on my channel to get familiar with how AI art generators work. At the bottom left of the prompt box, there's an image icon. I click on it, select the picture I want to animate, and upload it. Once uploaded, a small thumbnail of the image appears inside the prompt box. By clicking on it, you can view it in a larger size or even crop it before proceeding. Now, to bring a still image to life, all you need to do is write a prompt describing what should happen in the scene and which parts should move. You can ask the AI to make your character talk, laugh, get excited, or show sadness and anger. You can even animate the character's actions, make them walk, exercise, or dance with energy. Beyond that, you can bring the environment to life too, let it rain, make the wind blow, or create a full storm. The best part? There are absolutely no limits. Whatever idea you can imagine can come to life. Because the only boundary here is your imagination and the words you feed into the prompt. After writing the prompt, I leave the default settings as they are and click create. My request enters the queue. And within a short time, the still image turns into a dynamic video based on my text prompt. We can now preview the result in the video frame. The image to video results using Pixverse V5 are genuinely breathtaking. The quality and realism are so impressive that I can't help but be amazed. In the past, animating a single image like this could take days, or even weeks. But now, with just a few words and the power of AI, we can create something that was once nearly impossible even on the free plan. Did you find this tutorial helpful? If you did, then why haven't you smashed that like button yet? Hit the like, share this video with your friends. And don't forget, this tutorial is just a small drop in an ocean of AI content coming your way on this channel. If you're passionate about artificial intelligence, you're in the right place. Subscribe now and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss any of my upcoming tutorials. Remember, AI is the future. So embrace it today. I'll see you in the next one.